Local school districts are helping students who have fallen behind after an unusual school year. As part of our Back to School series, Local 12's Clancy Berg joins us now to tell us about one superintendent's message to parents. Good morning, Clancy. Hey, John, the big focus when students returned to school last year was safety. We were talking about things like one directional hallways and social distancing, and those things might still be implemented. But now the big focus is learning. The Ludlow Independent School District has already come up with a game plan, starting with summer school. This year, they have about double the amount of kindergartners and elementary school students who are enrolled, and that's because there are some who fell behind this year. Seven out of 11 grades tested at or above the national average but four grades are struggling and because of that the district is bringing in four interventionists to help students who need it they're also focusing on individualized programming so students can work on any specific needs they may have and they're actually assessing students in a few weeks to figure out where they stand teachers will then meet with students and parents to lay out a game plan superintendent Mike Borchers said teachers play a vital role in getting kids back on track and so do parents I think if they support their students this next year and make sure that their students do what's asked of them, that they put the time in when they do have to do homework or schoolwork, that if they follow the process that schools have in place, that they'll be able to close those gaps. Superintendent Borchers said there is some good that came from the pandemic. For instance, students are now better problem solvers and they can advocate for themselves. And he thinks when they return on August 18th, that's the first day for the Ludlow Independent School District, they'll be just fine. For now, reporting live, Clancy Burke, Local 12 News. All right, Clancy, thank you for that. Now, if you're interested in checking out more back to school stories, you can just head to our website, that's local12.com, and then click on back to school under the news tab.